every time. And we get an ice shield out of that chest. Let's go ahead and equip that onto Cecil. Because he is getting hit quite often. And I think he has a lower defense anyway. Uh, from 45-10 to 45-10. But we are now strong against ice. Really? One step again? I think that's scripted now. I'm, st I'm starting to think it's scripted. And as a result of every step... Well, not as a result of that last battle, but the one before that. Rosa leveled up and she was able to learn Cure 3. Nothing in here. I hate you, game. Uh, which is the next upgrade, as uh, Tella had before, but... Now Rosa has it, so I could use it in battle, should I desire. Mon monsters! Are you going to give me another new enemy? That'd be great if you did. Uh, keep fighting it. We do want the alert to go down first. Unfortunately, the status effects do not work. Oh, it's a flame dog. We've seen those up and down. But for this battle, we were able to get ourselves the ice mail. Uh, ice vest, ice armor, something to that effect. Let's go ahead and put that on Cecil as well. Goes from 45.10 to 47.10. Nice. And are you going to get in a fight every step? No! This time, they're fine with it. They're fine with me leaving. But once I step outside, it's a whole different thing. Now we can head back across the bridge that we had uh, seen before. It's the same bridge. But we can head through this door here, which should lead us to the next floor. It does. To floor number five. Because, well, where else were we going to go? Let us head up here. I saw that treasure chest. You can't sneak that by me. Let's head up here and grab ourselves 2,000 gil. Nice, I will take it. Even though I've been getting that in some fights lately, actually. Oh, and we do have new enemies here. We have Tofus. Uh, let's go ahead and take out the Chimera. Um, damn, you guys hit hard. Really? 42? Uh, you go ahead and try to hit the Chimera. Then. You... Really? The ice isn't even good enough. I swore because they had ice equipment on that it was going to be enough here, but I was wrong. Uh, you do need to cast Cure 2 on everybody while we're here. They're getting a little low. Nothing too bad, but I don't want to live in the danger zone if I don't have to. Down goes everything except for the Chimera, which I should be able to take out uh, once everybody... Can, can do damage when he's not in the back row anymore. You know what I mean? Blaze! No, hit everybody! Holy crap! Down goes a camera. That was a that was a hard ass attack. You got 1385 guild, 1096 experience, and uh, I do need to heal after that. Let us continue on. We need to head over to the east here. We're going to skip the middle path because obviously that's the path forward. We need to head... That's a dead end. Let's head to where I know there's a treasure chest, which is down here. Now I can see it. And in this treasure chest down here, we get a Cure 2 potion. So let's head back up. Go up this way because I'm pretty sure the other way will lead us further in the dungeon. Even though this does lead us to the floor, the next floor, it does look like a, a little bit of a, of a side area to me. Another alert enemy! Oh, we get to attack first. You don't say. Well, if I defeat it, yeah, I figure not. And it's just another flame dog. Now, is there anything down here for me to look at? No, but there is something up to the right. Two stone men. So let's go up into the right instead, because this looks like one of those magic rooms with a save point. I was actually going to say a treasure chest with monsters in it, but I will take a save point any day. Alright, now that that's done, we can continue on. Now the other path does lead further into the dungeon, as does this way actually, but we'll be going that other way eventually. We need to head this way right now. We do have a new enemy. We have a Medusa. I want her to die. I don't like being petrified. Luckily, we were able to take her out for a shot there. Damn, that stone man does hit hard though, but I hit, I hit him right back. There's no way around that. You get 465 kill, 840 experience, and we are free to move on. That Medusa. 
she does what all Medusas do. She stones you. Luckily, Petrify is not something that carries between battles in this game, actually, unless you get fully stoned. Are you going to show me something new, you alert? I'm waiting for something new. No! So let's go over to the west here. We can get ourselves another Ether 2. And we'll take it. Let's head up here then. And we can continue on into here. And here, we find ourselves on the 8th floor. Which we can go only one way. Oh no, who's that up there? It's Dr. Luge. Master Rubicon, please be careful. Eblon has fallen, so the threat is gone. You'll take care of this place when I'm gone. Uh oh. The hell happened there? He just warped on out of here. So you're in charge, Dr. Luge, are you? I don't like the sound of that music at all. Golbez and Rubicon both are gone. Now I'm the leader here. Weird guy. You know what this guy sounds like? This sounds like introduction to a boss fight where he uses status effects. That's what this sounds like to me. Who's there? Oops. Cecil! Won't you call for help, Doctor? Don't take me lightly or you'll get burned. It makes me laugh. Now face my beloved child, Balnob! And it's boss time up against, uh, yeah, Dr. Lugai and Balnob. Go, Balnob! Okay, is he going? I can't even tell. He's just standing there, freaking Frankenstein-looking thing. Oh, he hit Dr. Lugai. <laughs> That's awesome. Let's go for a kick. We'll see how much damage that does. Damn, over there! Uh, what? Beat them up! Uh, fire bad. Uh, let's go ahead and use our strongest stuff. Let's go for, for Titan here. Uh, that does okay. Alright, we're gonna go for an aim on Balnob. Hopefully we can take him out first. Let's go for a regular attack there. I didn't heal all the way before this fight. Probably should have, but I want to save as much MP as I can. Go, Titan! I will show off the rest of the summons eventually. But right now we need to use Titan. And down goes Balnob! Aim at Dr. Luge! Dr. Lugi? I'm gonna go with Luge, otherwise I could hawk him. Oh, my dear. I will operate him. What? Huh? Oh, I'll, I'll operate him directly now. Okay. Oh, and he climbs right on top to form... Balnob Z. Let's try another Titan. And then, oh, crap. Uh, yeah, just a cure two straight on right here. Let's get her recovered so she can summon Titan. Well, she probably could anyway, but still jump on him. Damn me, it's hard. Go, Titan! He's not a teen, though. He's just a regular Titan. And down goes Balnob. Damn, right here, you strong. Well, Titan, but still. I'll show you my real strength. And it's follow-up boss time. Like, didn't we just fight you? What the hell's going on here? Now the real fight! Then... Watch what? What the hell is that? Oh, when he casts poison on the entire party. And of course it hit everybody. Why wouldn't it hit everybody? Go, Titan! Gas! But it missed! Beam! But that didn't miss. Alright, now that he's back on the ground, let's go ahead and cure him before he dies. Damn it, Kane. Stand up. Uh, well, you can't stand up because you're all poisoned. But still. Holy crap. No, no, no. 
We need Rosa back. Gas is not supposed to work on anybody, but at least her poison's gone. That's nice. Go, Titan! Damn, this does so much damage. Gas missed again. A mission. That didn't do much of anything. I was scared there. I'm scared Rosa wasn't going to make it. Gas missed again. Damn, this guy has a ton of HP. Go, Titan. Heal. The hell he healed us. Alright, let's cure three, everybody. Why not cure three? That doesn't do anything to this. Right here, what the hell, Rosa? Why'd you die? But luckily, everybody's mostly back to normal. One more, one more Titan or, or Jump should be able to do it. I don't know why he healed us. That's so crazy that he would even do that. Titan! Down goes Dr. Luge. And for that fight, we get 4,000 gil, 3,000 experience. Rosa gains a level. She learned size. She learned mini. That's the way I was playing. We get the tower key, which is glowy because it's special and awesome. This Tower of Babel connects the ground and underground. Didn't we kill you like three times? How are you still talking? Rubicon has already moved all the crystals to the upper world, and I shall annihilate the dwarves with my super cannon! <sighs> then he freaking ninja bombed himself out of here. Dwarves are in danger! Yes, they are, Radia. We must stop the super cannon! Thank you, Yang. We must destroy it. You got Yang, Kane. Uh, fine, I'll do it. Set the warp device, but we can't use it. We can't use it. Uh, let's let's go up here. Surely, surely there's a so there's a switch up here. The, the save the day switch? No, of course not. So it's back the way that we came. Unfortunately. So, really, you can get in boss fights on this floor? I guess why not? So it is back the way that we came. Back to the save point. Because we need to go back to the place. Remember I said, hey, this leads further into the tower. <laughs> but we can't... Well, we didn't go that way. The reason why is because we couldn't because we needed this key. But now that we have this key for defe defeating the... Well, the Hojo prototype. <laughs> we need to go back to the save point here. And we can save and rest. And get all the MP back that I spent on, get on using Titan. And that is actually going to do it for these parts of Let's Play Final Fantasy IV. I've been Baller Scuba. I've been joined, as always, by my trusty squad of Kane, Radius, Cecil, Rosa, and Yang. When we come back, we will continue climbing the Tower of Babil. Babil. It's so weird how they spell it. Hope you guys have enjoyed these parts. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching.